Crime is out of control in Democrat cities. And far-left politicians soft on crime policies are inciting even more crime and violence. Delusional Democrats are actually trying to deny that this crime spree exists. Thieves stole $120,000 of merchandise from this clothing store in Chicago. 80 criminals ransacked this store in San Francisco, then escaped in waiting getaway cars. Carjackings are up 44% in Chicago, 45% in Washington, and 81% in New York. Homicides are up 72% in Minneapolis, 73% in Seattle, and 83% in Portland. And arsonists even burned down Fox News' Christmas tree in New York City. Despite this crime wave, Democrats are still trying to defund the police, end cash bail, and weaken legal penalties for criminals. And don't forget, Kamala Harris promoted a bail fund for rioters last year. And many liberal Soros-funded district attorneys are more focused on letting criminals free than sending them to jail. Meanwhile, Democrats continue to turn their backs and demonize law enforcement, trying to fire thousands of them through these vaccine mandates. American families deserve to be safe in their own communities, and they will reject Biden and the Democrats' weak public safety agenda come November. And that's the Paris Perspective, powered by the RNC.